Welcome in, y'all. Welcome in to Sharon's Nail Boutique. Welcome, baddies and babies. I hope y'all are doing well. I hope y'all will stick around and consider liking and subscribing if you are not already. This is the set that I did in this video, so I hope that you like this demonstration. I did a little ASMR for y'all. <clears throat> Excuse me. I've been, I don't know what's going on lately with me, but I have like really no direction artistically lately. I've been wanting to do a whole bunch of stuff and I'm kind of all over the place, but let's get right into this. And I hope you'll like and subscribe to this channel. And with that being said, let's get right into me pushing my cuticles back on all five fingernails. And I'm going to be going in with my F Xanas peel off base coat, which I really must say, I'm not a huge fan of this peel off base coat. And I think it's simply because it works for the most part until you get to the edge of your finger and then it starts wanting to rip off the tip of your nail. And that's super painful. I don't like that. And so to me, it just seems like it's a waste. And the only reason why I'm using it is because I don't want to waste it. And yeah, I know I shouldn't be putting my nails through that. but. I mean, we're all guilty of it, I think. So I'm just finishing up that base coat and I will put these into my lamp to cure for 60 seconds because I have a hybrid lamp. And then I'll be using my Kala Super Glue to glue on my tips. And my tips are actually from, it's a place I think, I cannot pronounce it. It's Aerofon. I believe, let me see. I know that I will leave them in the description index below for you. And when I get a chance to, I will also go through and get that information up in them other videos as well. These tips are called extra long full cover tips, 240 piece soft gel tips. Okay, let's see the name, that should help. I don't even see a name on here. That's crazy. All it says is extra long full cover tips, 240 piece box. Beauty starts at your fingertips. 12 sizes, clear numbers, soft gel tips, the fastest and most professional nail enhancements ever made. Okay, so they're just tips. They're coffin, extra long coffin tips. And actually, I've been wanting to use my stiletto tips because I have not done a mean stiletto set in forever. So I was actually fitting to get ready to use those today and something came up and I didn't use them. But I did do another really cool design for you guys, like a sunset type of background with some like lacy type of design. And so on this pinky, I am going in with this beautiful glitter by Queen of Bling Nails and Beauty. I just love this glitter mix. I actually got it in the Christmas glitter group swap last year that she did. And she did a Secret Santa, which I also joined, which was also a lot of fun. And I got a lot of cool stuff in that as well. So I'm encapsulating the glitter and then I'll come in at that cuticle area with my Mia Secret Cool Pink. I have something cool in store for the three center fingers. And then on the thumb, I do another glitter ombre, like the pinky. And I also put on a couple of those gold holographic snowflakes that you see in that container there. So there's a few things that I have in store. I was thinking about using those little pieces in the background there, but I ended up kind of I'm opting out of doing that so let me know what types of designs you would like to see me do next and let me know what you think of these last few designs if you like them if you want them to stick around if you like the themed designs what are your preferences let me know what you guys think in the comments below so moving forward we're just going to finish off with that bead and it should look like it's coming right out of the back eponychium so so flush check this out y'all look at how clean that looks and so when you come in with your file and shape in and around that cuticle area it's gonna look so badass and i'm gonna come in with my mia secret clear and i'm gonna encapsulate that nail and it's gonna be protected so that when we do come in and file it's gonna be all set 
it's a too probably big of a bead, but that's okay. You make mistakes, we all make mistakes. So just making sure that all that glitter is capped and you'll know this because it'll all look matte in appearance and that's all set. So I'm gonna move on to my thumbnail and I'm gonna be doing the same type of nail, like I said, except I'm gonna be adding those gold holographic snowflakes that you see right there. So I'm gonna pull a couple of those out and I'm gonna start laying that glitter by Queen of Bling Nails and Beauty and you can find her over on Instagram and you can find her here on YouTube. If I could get the link to her channel, I will also post that below. I have been so antsy lately. I just, I don't know what it is. Just can't stop moving. So just patting that around, making sure that my glitter is nice and flat because when you do come in and encapsulate your glitter, you want to make sure that your clear acrylic can seep in and around them glitters and cover it all up nicely. You don't want big bulkiness because then it's going to be very difficult to cap. So I'm going to cap that and then I'm going to come in with my cool pink and start blending that into the glitter. I think it looks so, so pretty. I love this glitter because of like the pink pieces that are in it. I think it just takes the glitter mix up a notch, a whole bunch of notches. And I'm going to finish off this set, allow you guys to kind of sit back and chill without me talking through the entire thing. Sit and listen to this Christmas music and enjoy this design. I have airbrush coming up as well, so don't miss out on that. And as you can see, I've left pictures in the beginning for y'all to relate to. And that's it. I hope you guys will like and subscribe to my channel. I have a lot more in store and I'm going to be graduating soon. So I'll be doing pedicures and everything soon. So I love y'all so much and I will see you in my next one. Bye.